Hi, I'm uh, Whit Brockner, and this is sort of like an introduction to masks and locking transparency and uh, a few other little tricks to painting trees and clouds and mountains. Uh, some basic landscape stuff. Um, but really, it's an it's a interesting way of creating shapes you wouldn't normally get uh, with just erasing out or um, straight painting. It's just going to be a simple tree, but it's going to be an awesome tree. This tree is going to blow your mind. You can see where the mask is by hitting backslash. By default, it shows up as red. Um, so you can see, you know, if you're masking something out, where it'll show up where it won't. If you do it at gray, it'll show up half, just like that. Very simple. Let's, uh, let's paint a mountain real quick. Okay. And to do that, you just start with a opaque shape, very basic. Don't want to destroy that since we've already gotten it. So we'll mask it and we'll just give it sort of a more interesting edge. Basically whenever you want to be able to change a shape, but in a non-destructive way, you know, change it back. Masks are your ideal tool.